Continuing with our turtle guard attack, we're going to now go into a crucifix position. So, we're here, we're going to start it up. We're going to start the same way. We're going to dig our knee in through here, drive down, foot up. What we're going to do now is we're going to isolate this arm. So we're underneath, grabbing this one, grab lapel, doesn't matter for this. This hand grabs your own knee. We're going to slide our knee out just a bit because we want to create some space. You can pin it to the mat and keep it here if they're doing being really strong. We're going to bring this foot over, walk over. As soon as your foot passes, pull it straight back. From here, you can switch your legs or keep it here. doesn't matter. We've isolated the arm. This hand now, we dig in for a choke. We can finish a choke here, but a lot of times when this happens, they try to do a front roll. So they roll. We let them roll. From here, we do our hair. We pinch our knees and you see, I'm flaring my knees out this way. It pulls them on top. From here, all we have to do is dig in, grab the choke, finish it this way, or behind the head. Now, what happens a lot, let's say when you roll, this slides up. His arm starts coming out. As soon as you feel this, we're gonna grab a Kimura grip here. They're gonna try to turn in, they can't turn away. We're gonna lift this up. What this does is you can see there's a pocket here. We slide a leg through, we lift him up, we come over, we leap back attacks, we can go to arm bar, whatever you want. 